Humans have been on Earth for millions of years and have been able to change their living conditions with increasing progress. Imagine 100 years ago, who would have thought that the world would look like this today? That the internet has created a world of separation. Cars are seen more in cities than humans. Thousands of flights occur daily. What about another hundred years? What world should we wait for? Can you imagine a future in which humans communicate through thinking? Or can they prevent aging? Ever wondered what the Earth's climate might be like in another hundred years? We invite you to join us in this video to explore these issues together. Welcome to our channel, where you are going to see amazing things. We are very happy to have you on our channel. Be sure to hit the bell button and be the first to hear about our new videos. Deserts will become forests. It can be said that humans have achieved a lot in the field of geology and are still growing rapidly. In the process that man is going through, it seems that in another century, man will be able to turn deserts into forests. Habitat Antarctica the human population is growing. Given that the human population may reach 10 billion in the next 100 years, with the construction of strong houses, humans will be able to live in Antarctica and build small towns there. Humans will make Antarctica a place to live for the next 100 years. Is it believable living in Antarctica? Oceans as a food source. We will face a shortage of drinking water as the population grows. This may happen in another hundred years. If the planet's population grows at the same rate, it will reach more than 10 billion people. In this case, not enough food will be available to everyone. In addition to fish, humans must extract water from algae in the oceans and genetically modify it into drinking water. It's hard, but it may be the only way left at that time. All the people of the world use a common currency. The economic changes that are happening every day in the world will create a common currency around the world for the next hundred years. This makes the process of economic growth more regular and, on the other hand, helps weaker countries to grow economically. In this case, people will no longer have a problem with business and travel, and everything will be much easier. There will only be three languages in the world. There are speculations that in the next hundred years, there will only be English, Spanish, and Chinese. The rest of the languages will probably disappear little by little. It is also said that 80% of the world's teenagers will be able to speak these three languages. Given that the world economy is moving in this direction right now, especially about Chinese and English, it can be very accurate. Space travel for everyone. Given the progress that humans have made in space, it is possible that space accommodations will be built and even tourist centers will be opened in space. However, ordinary people cannot afford such a trip. Most celebrities and rich people will go on these trips. Human intelligence will increase mutations. Given the advances in nanotechnology and neuroscience, humans can understand the mechanism of intelligence for the next 100 years and increase it with the help of medicine and education. It remains to be seen what other things this development of the mind can cause. Nanobots can travel inside the body's arteries. Scientists are building targeted robots that can travel through the arteries of the human body to reach specific organs and perform healing tasks on the body. These nanobots can even enter the brain and repair damaged parts. You would be very shocked to say that they can also copy human memory. Communicate with other human beings through thinking. Although stated as a possibility, humans can likely communicate with other human brains only through thinking and telepathy. 
Advances in the field of neuroscience, etc., will cause this issue. Today, however, small electronic chips have been developed that, along with the human brain, can increase the brain's ability to communicate with new methods. But these chips are still in the testing phase. Hide the internet in your eyes. You get excited thinking about going online in just the blink of an eye, right? This topic may be used in everyday life until the end of the century. Although stated as a possibility, humans can likely communicate with other human brains only through thinking and telepathy. Scientists have predicted that the internet will be exposed to the lens of the eye, and you can connect to the internet wherever you want. With these lenses, you can recognize other people's faces, put subtitles for their words. This advantage can be very useful when a person speaks another language. This way, you can understand what he means. In addition, with these lenses, you can go back in time and walk in history. With the help of this technology, you can check your health factors, such as blood sugar, blood pressure, etc. Humans will be able to control the weather. The technology that humans have today is the ability to control and influence climate change to reduce its destructive effects. But with the advancement of technology, there is a possibility that in the future we will overcome tornadoes and any destructive climate change and keep them off. Today, humans have access to a range of climate control technologies, but these technologies are predicted to be much more advanced than they were in the past. Of course, it will not be used daily and universally, and because of its high cost, only scientists can use it in emergencies. Spaceman I think we're going to get a message from space by the end of this century. Although this conversation is unlikely, they're probably hundreds of light years away, said Michio Kaku, a Japanese-American physicist. That's why dialogue can take hundreds of years, but humans can reach a turning point because of it. Prevent aging. Man has been seeking eternal life and preventing aging since the beginning of his life, but still, despite the great progress of science, man has not been able to find a cure to prevent aging. But we hope that with the advancement of technology, this will happen in the next 100 years. Scientists have been able to understand what the aging process is, and in this way, they may be able to reverse or prevent it. Finally, one of the things we very much hope humans can overcome over time and the advancement of technology is the aging process. Putting human consciousness in the laser beam. There is a strange prediction about the human condition in the next hundred years. By the end of the century, a project will be carried out that can place human consciousness in a laser beam. This beam can be sent into space, to the moon in one second, to Mars in 20 minutes, and during four hours to reach the nearest star to Earth. Fly with your cars. How many times have you been stuck in traffic and wished you could fly in your car? It is predicted that this will happen in less than 100 years, and you will have cars that do not need a driver and can fly due to magnetic laws. At that time, traffic becomes a meaningless word, and cars travel in such a way that there is no traffic. They certainly will not be as good as airplanes, but even for short distances, it can be very cool. There is still no cure for cancer. It is predicted that molecular smart bombs will form molecules that block cancer cells before they spread. Chemotherapy is an obsolete method. But because of the variety and high rate of cancer proliferation, it will still be incurable. The point of all of these films is that the future world of humans is an all-digital world, and humans will happen to survive on all the possibilities of the planet. Human health is increasing unbelievably. These are just some of the goal-setting shareware that you can use in the next 100 years. 
We do not know where the changes are taking us, but we always hope that humans will find a way to live better. It is estimated that there will be other changes in the Earth's climate, which are explained in detail. But it is better to pay more attention to the issue of global warming and provide more information. So be sure to share your opinions with us and say which part of the video was the most exciting for you. And even thinking about it raises your heart rate. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel.